today we are discussing the one more concept power scenario in india how much power was generated in india what are the sectors is available and what are the sources we are using and generate the power and how many regions is there how to distribute the power in india we are discussing first if you go for the the installed capacity the power installed capacity in india 412.212 gigawatts 412.212 gigawatts power this is the installed capacity installed power capacity in india this is the installed power capacity in india this power we can categorize it in three sectors one is the central sector second one is the state sector third one is the private sector first one is the central central sector second one is the state se state sector third one is the private sector private sector private sector in central sector the power generation 24.20 total is the 100% is a power total power is the 412.212 gig 212 gigawatts power this power 100 power 100% is a power generation in india is the 412.212 gigawatts power in this total power we can categorize into three sectors central government was generating in 24.20 percentage and the states government was generating in 25.40 and private private companies was generating in power 55.40 percentage this is the uh, sectors this is the power generation in sector the what are the sources we are using to generate the power in india we can categorize in two types one is the fossil fuel second one is the fossil fuel non fossil fuel the fossil fuel we are using a fossil fuel, uh, fuel is uh, 57.40 power generation in non fossil is the 42.60 power generation is expected if you go for the fossil fuel is the coal 49.70 percentage we are using the coal to generate the power 49.70 percentage after lignite 1.60 gas 6.10 diesel 0.10 total 57.40 this is the we are using the fossil fuel to generate the power 57.40 percentage of the power we are using this fossil fuel to generate the power after we go for non fossil fuel non fossil fuel hydro 11.40 wind 10.40 solar 15.60 and bm power 2.50 waste we are using the waste material to generate the power 0.1 percentage and the small hydro power plants 1.20 and nuclear is the 1.60 these are all the renewable energy sources year to year we are using this nuclear is the 1.60 these are all comes under the non fossil fuel we are using a non fossil fuel to generate the power in india 42.60 percentage total generation is the 100% is the 100% is the power is the 412.212 gigawatts power generation is takes place in india india is the in, uh, in india is the third largest installed capacity in power compared to some other countries first one first place is the china second place is the united states third place is the india in installed capacity wise after go for a uh, power consume point of view also india is the third largest country compared to some other countries the power consumption also first place in china 
second place is the united states third place is the india in india the power generation we can categorize it into five regions one is the north region second one is the west region third one is the southern region fourth one is the east region fifth one is uh, fifth one is the north east region these are the five regions is available power generation in india first if you go for the north region in this north region have nine states is available in that north region the power generation is takes place in north region 26 power 26 percentage of the power generation is take place in this north region if you after if you go for the west region in this west region have five states is available in this west region the power generation 34 percentage of the power generation is takes place in this region after if you go for the southern region in this southern region six states is available in this southern region 28 percentage of the power generation is generating in this region after if you go for the east region east region is the five states is available in the east region the power generation is takes place in 11 percentage of the power generation is takes place in this region after if you go for the northeast region in this northeast region seven states is available in this northeast regions the power generation is takes place only one percentage of the power generation is generating in this region in this region these is available in new delhi west region is available in mumbai southern region is available available in bangalore east region is available in kolkata north east region is available in shillong these five regions coordination these five regions coordination is the general dc national load dispatch center is available in Delhi. NLDC is also is available in Delhi. These all five regions, these all five regions supervising, supervising is doing. These all five regions supervising will be doing. In case any power demand is more, any one of the regions, suppose this, uh, this region have power demand is more in this region power generation is more that time the power the power we can transmit this regions to this regions this uh, work this work was doing in nldc national load dispatch center and that time they are monitoring the parameters this region parameters and this region parameters they are monitoring the parameters and as well as safety point of view also um, uh, operations operations and to transmit the power from uh, this regions to this regions uh, voltage and frequency they are matching and how the power was generating from this this region to this region with help of uh, HVDC or HVAC high voltage DC current and high voltage AC current we can transmit the power this these all reason coordination will take place only the NLDC NLDC National Load Dispatch Center this is available in Delhi RLDCs total RLDCs is five numbers RLDCs is there N RLDC W RLDC S RLDC East RLDC Northeast RLDC these five are the RLDC RLDC means regional load dispatcher center regional load dispatcher center these load these are five regional load dispatch centers is monitoring is NLDC national load dispatcher center after if you go for the especially for southern region in the southern regions have six states is available in this six states state to state six states is available in case any state uh, power is uh, demand is more one state power demand is less generation is more that time we can transmit the power 
in one state to another state after a one state to other state that is the sldc that will take care about the sldc means state load dispatch center this sldc is sldc means state load dispatch center suppose you, uh, this uh, sldc is, is available in six states six uh, sldc is available this these are all six states coordinating with rldc this rldc is available in bangalore this rldc is coordinating this all six states any state is power demand is less we can transmit uh, economy basis we can transmit and they will take care about the monitoring the parameters and how to, we can transmit the power uh, and we can uh, planning any very generation is required they all things they will take care about the rldc this rldc rldc is available in bangalore this all this all regions six states coordination or supervising will do the rld this all states sld six sldc is available in this region this six sld is coordinating with coordinating the rldc regional load dispatch center this sldc means state load dispatch center state load dispatch center